Hey everybody, so today's question is reconstruct eternally. So in this, we have given some list of tickets. In those tickets, we have given the two airports that have our pair of departure and arrival airports. So, so what we have to do is we have to find the final route that we can take starting from JFK airport so that we can go to all the airports and there are some routes like they have said if there are multiple routes then please give the route that have smaller lexical order also they have said that there will be always at least one valid itinerary which means that we don't have to check if it is valid or not because it will always be valid so for example we have so for example we have our input like this so this means from the airport MUC we can go to LHR from JFK we can go to MUC from SFO we can go to SJC and from LHR we can go to SFO that our starting destination should be JFK so starting from JFK we will see that what are the possibilities where we can go we see that there is only one possibility that we can go to MUC so we will go to MUC then going to MUC we will see from there what are the possibilities that of moving forward we see that on we can go to LHR only so we will go to LHR then we will see that what are the possibilities from there to move forward from LHR we can only go to SFO so we will go to SFO then from SFO we will see where we can go that we can only go to SJC so we will go to SJC and we got our output so we got the final list as we can firstly go to JFK then MUC then LHR then SFO and then SJC so also there was written that it should be in lexical order so what does this mean this means that if from our airport we have multiple options so we should choose the one that will come first in lexical order for example from LHR if we have to move forward and if we have these two options like MUC and SFO so we know in lexical order we will get MUC first so we will take MUC so talking about how can we implement this question we can pretty much implement it the way we have seen it so how so we can form a graph in which we can store the first airports as the key and their final destinations as the value so that we can easily check from which airport what are the possible ways we can go out, um, what are the possible ways we can move forward then iterating over all the airports like using dfs we can easily check so let's see its implementation so what our first step should be so our first step should be to form a graph in which we have starting airports as the key and the possible next destinations as its value so I have formed a function in which I have taken input list of lists in which we have strings as tickets and firstly I have formed a graph then in graph this line means that the keys are the first starting positions and I have appended the final destination in it then then we are sorting all the final destinations in our graph but in reverse order so why are we sorting it and why are we sorting in it in reverse order so we know that if we have many answers the we have to give the answer in lexical order so how can we do that F so to achieve that we are sorting it but we are sorting it reverse because we know that in a list when we want to remove an element from the last it is o1 but from the first it is o n operation so that's why we are sorting it in reverse order so that we get our value with minimum number of operations so our last element will be the most preferable choice because it is sorted then then i have taken a stack and given it value jfk that's the starting value because they have given that we have to start from jfk in this stack what i will take is i will keep the note of where i am at the current position so for example i am at jfk so from this tag I know that I am at JFK so I can easily check that what are the next possibilities of destination where I can go from the current value and 
the rest list is our result so as we got a fixed value we will append it in our result list so what i am doing is i am taking the last value of the stack seeing its all possibilities as the graph of stack minus 1 are all the values that now we can go possibly and then removing our this value from the stack because we have moved on it then whenever we will get that there are no ways to move forward from a particular airport we will append it in our result so the first thing that will get append in our result will be the last answer means the ending point of our route because in the starting it is the only point from where we can't go any further but as we will reach there we will remove it by popping and then what we will append in our result will be the last second and then last third and that's how we will get our result as the final list and finally we will reverse our result list and we will give it in the perfect order so these are the steps that we need to follow so that we can perfectly implement our solution so firstly we will form a graph with keys with starting airport as keys and the destination as its value so that we can easily find the destinations then then we will sort all the destination in lexical order then we will take the count that where are we in the current position and then we will see from all the next possibilities what are the next possibilities and so on with the help of dfs and whenever we will get to a point where we can't move forward then we know that this is our end result so we will append it in our result and finally we will return our result list in an opposite way so i hope this is clear now try to implement it by yourself this question can also be done by the help of eulerian path you can find the link to that approach in the description below and thanks for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.